Blink. What is the first thing you notice? Simply no transition. But what if universe tells you that an angel is getting close to you and will meet you within 5 days from now? Does this surprise you? Then you will appreciate what comes next in this message. So don't skip ahead and watch this video completely. Comment yes if you believe in God and do help support us through Super Chat. The universe is sending you a message that indicates a shift and alteration in your life. The universe is telling you that there are big changes coming soon. This modification are connected to your job connections with other and your own development. An angel is coming into your room at night to give abundance and prosperity in your life. The sight of an angel is a symbol that represents a deep message of abundance, success, good luck and prosperity. The universe is sending a message that the angel is seen as a special animal. It may manifest in your dream. In the realm of slumber where reality and imagination intertwine, a vivid and enchanting dream will unfold. Amidst the velvety darkness, a majestic animal will get materialized, its form brimming with significance and promise. It will as though the universe had cast a celestial spotlight upon this creature, illuminating it as a bearer of auspicious tidings. Seeing an angel whether in a dream or in real life is often considered a symbol of good fortune and success. The universe is communicating to you that it is guiding and supporting you. As your eyes meet the creature's gaze, an inexplicable sense of tranquility will envelop the surroundings. The air itself will seem to vibrate with a subtle energy, an intangible connection between the dreamer's spirit and the essence of animal. This creature, a symbol of ancient wisdom and divine guidance, stood before you with a demeanor both regal and gentle. Its eyes hold a depth and transcendent words, carrying within them the secrets of the universe. In their depths, one could discern a promise, a whisper of forthcoming blessings and positive shifts in the cosmic fabric. This profound experience will change you forever. Now the universe wants to tell you another very important thing, gratitude matters. The universe wants you to know that if you concentrate on the things you already have instead of what you don't have, you will attract more wealth and success. The universe wants you to appreciate the good things in your life and to think about the positive parts of your experiences. The angel symbolizes the importance of being prepared to receive abundance. You should welcome and accept the many opportunities and resources that are accessible to you. You are gaining strength and toughness which reminds you that you have the ability to overcome these beliefs that hold you back and accept the abundance that is waiting for you. The universe wants you to remind you to stop worrying and being afraid. Feeling bad can stop you from getting good things and make it hard to enjoy what's happening right now. The angel is demonstrating bravery and power motivating you to confront your fears and proceed with assurance. The universe is sending you a message that you were linked to higher spiritual forces. You must know that in order to receive lots of good things in future it's important to think, want and do things that match the way the universe works. The angel wants you to have a positive and grateful attitude. It believes that your thoughts and feelings affect how you see the world. 
when you appreciate and feel thankful for the things you already have and imagine having more of what you want you create. You were connected to a vast network of energy and intelligence that is always there to guide and support you. When you allow yourself to be open to the messages and signs that the universe is sending you, the angel help you to learn how to get go off to the belief that there is not enough which can often hold you back from reaching your full potential. Being grateful is like having a special key that opens the doors to success and abundance. It helps you see and appreciate the good things that are already a part of your life. When you recognize and appreciate everything, you have such a relationships, opportunities and resources, you create a fertile environment for even more abundance to grow. Having patience and trust is really important when you want to have a lot of good things in your life. The angel wants to remind you that everything happens at the right time according to a higher power. It motivates you to let go of wanting instant outcomes and instead have faith in the natural flow of the world. The father says today, it's been a difficult season but the results of the oppositions has been an increase in your faith and determination to see my will accomplished in the earth. Your time has been well spent as you have learned to trust me on deeper levels and many times with life altering situations. But I am turning all these things around and working them all together for your good. You love me and are called according to my purposes. The Father says today in your life, it is time for a decree. It is the hour to let your mouth declare and decree some things you've been believing for. As you declare and decree a thing, says God, it will come to pass because in your decree, you are coming into agreement with my heart and what I've had planned for you all along. The things you are asking are in my heart. Don't question or wonder about this. I want you to have a settled answer in your inner man about my unswerving determination to give you the desires of your heart. Know that in the asking there is a demonstration. You are going to see a demonstration of what I am bringing to pass in the near future. It will be as the earnest of a fresh inheritance and the down payment of my unfolding goodness. I want you to believe him to open your mouth and pray over, prophesy over other people as well. Because this is a gift of my spirit that's locked up on the inside of you. And it is even now breaking open and being called forth my gifts, my callings that's been in you and with you throughout your life for there without repentance. Words of transformation are coming. There are words of encouragement edification, and exhortation out of, because that is the inherent nature of my prophetic voice on the inside of you. There are words of wisdom bubbling up, words of knowledge on the inside of you for I purpose, says God. And I am determined to use you as an example of my goodness and my kindness and my kind my kind can instilled in the inside of you. I will speak through you and perform signs, miracles and signs through you on a day-to-day -day basis. I will even show you some things in the times to come, and you are going to sit back and relax, enjoy, and laugh because you know that it's a direct result of believing my word and allowing me to use you in a radical way, says God. So, believe in the Lord your God, and my establishing will establish you. Believe my prophets, and surely, surely you are going to prosper. Take it to the bank that I am going to use you in the future, and these little things that you're feeling after, as you sense to feel. You listen to hear, 
you are just tracking the Holy Spirit. And he said, I'm pleased to bring to pass in full in your life and the lives of those around you. Have you ever felt the world around you teeming with untold promises, just waiting for the moment you speak your heart's deepest desires? Imagine your words transforming into decrees, each syllable resonating with the very heart of the universe, aligning your dreams with the cosmos. Picture this, my dear friend, as you breathe life into your declarations. You enter into a profound covenant with the Creator Himself. Your desires, the very ones that have been etched into the tapestry of your soul, are mirrored in the heart of the Divine. There's no room for doubt or questioning, for within you resides an unwavering faith in God's unrelenting resolve to bring your heart's desires to fruition. In this act of asking, a grand spectacle is unveiled. The near future unfolds like the first chapter of a thrilling novel, a down payment on the benevolence the universe is yet to bestow upon you. You, my friend, are destined to be a living testament to God's grace and His goodness, a vessel through which His profound transformations are to be wrought. Now, here's where it gets truly exciting the dawn of profound wisdom, the outpouring of edifying words, and the gifts of knowledge are gushing forth from the wellspring of your being. You're becoming an embodiment of God's compassion, kindness, and an eloquent voice for His love. Prepare yourself for daily miracles, for your words shall bear fruits that resonate in hearts far and wide. Take it to heart, my friend that God's promise is your foundation, His prophets, your guiding stars. Prosperity is yours for the taking. The Holy Spirit is tracking with you, leading the way to the fulfillment of your life's purpose. So, believe in the boundless potential your faith carries for a glorious tomorrow awaits you. As you feel, hear, and embrace the Divine Presence, you're becoming an instrument of God's radiant love. And you, my dear friend, are the architect of your destiny. Now, this raises an important question, what will you do with this revelation? Your guardian angels have gone out of their way to share this celestial message with you. Could it be a sign that you're stepping into a new, even more impactful chapter of your own journey? And if so, are you ready for it? You've already accomplished so much just by being you, but this could be the universe's way of preparing you for even greater things. If you've listened to this message and felt a resonance know that it's no mere coincidence, the universe doesn't make mistakes. Every step you've taken and every challenge you've faced has led you to become this inspiring figure. Isn't it incredible how life's puzzle pieces fit together to create this amazing picture? Others, too, are poised to be touched by your radiant energy as you continue on your journey. May your guardian angels guide you towards endless opportunities to shine even brighter. Now listen to this prayer as it holds divine blessings and essence. O oh Lord, as I lift my voice to you in prayer, I am awestruck by your majesty and the magnificence of your creation. From the vastness of the cosmos to the intricate beauty of the smallest living beings, your handiwork is evident everywhere I look. I stand in awe of your power and wisdom, and I am humbled by the privilege of being in your presence. Heavenly Father, I am aware of the challenges and adversities that surround us in this world. The enemies of our souls seek to undermine our faith, disrupt our lives, and lead us away from your loving embrace. I implore you, Lord, to shield us from these malevolent forces, to place a hedge of protection around us, and to grant us the strength to stand firm in the face of adversity. Guard our hearts, minds, and spirits against the schemes of the enemy, and let your light dispel all darkness. 
Father, I long for spiritual progress and growth in my journey with you. As I traverse the path of faith, I yearn for a deeper relationship with you, a greater understanding of your word, and a heart that overflows with love for you and for others. May your Holy Spirit be my constant guide, illuminating the scriptures and revealing the profound truths contained within. Grant me the wisdom to discern your will and the courage to follow it. Lord, your word tells us that if anyone lacks wisdom, they should ask you, the generous giver, and it will be given to them. I come before you now, seeking the precious gift of wisdom. In a world filled with noise and confusion, help me to discern your voice amidst the clamor. Grant me the wisdom to make choices that align with your will and that lead me closer to your perfect plan for my life. Heavenly Father, in a world marked by turmoil and unrest, I earnestly seek your peace and serenity. Let your presence be a calming balm to my weary soul and grant me the strength to remain steadfast in my faith. May your peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard my heart and mind in Christ Jesus. In the midst of life's storms, help me to find solace in your abiding love. Lord, your word assures us that you are a lamp to our feet and a light to our path. I beseech you for guidance and direction in every aspect of my life. Lead me in the way that is pleasing to you and reveal your divine purpose for my existence. Illuminate the path before me and grant me the courage to follow it, trusting in your unfailing guidance. Father, there are times when life's challenges seem insurmountable and my strength falters. In those moments, I turn to you, the source of all strength and endurance. Fill me with your might and let your grace be sufficient for me. Help me to soar on wings like eagles, to run and not grow weary, to walk and not faint. May I find renewed strength in you each day. Lord, you are the great healer, capable of mending broken hearts, bodies and spirits. I lift up to you those who are in need of your healing touch. Whether the ailment is physical, emotional, or spiritual, I trust in your power to bring about restoration and wholeness. May your healing hand be upon those who suffer, bringing comfort, relief, and renewed vitality. Heavenly Father, I am acutely aware of my imperfections and my need for your forgiveness and grace. I come before you with a contrite heart, confessing my sins and shortcomings. I ask for your mercy to wash over me, cleansing me from all unrighteousness. Grant me the ability to extend forgiveness to others as I have received it from you. Lord, you are the provider of all our needs, and your storehouses are never empty. I place before you my concerns and needs, trusting in your abundant provision. Whether it is material, emotional, or spiritual, I trust in your faithfulness to supply all that is required. May your blessings overflow in my life and in the lives of those I love. Father, I yearn for the fruits of the Spirit to flourish within me, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. May these attributes be evident in my interactions with others, reflecting your divine nature and drawing people closer to you. Transform my character, Lord, and make me a vessel of your love. Heavenly Father, your word encourages us to live in unity and harmony with one another. I lift up to you our relationships, both within our families and among our friends and communities. May the bonds of love and fellowship be strengthened, and may your peace reign in our hearts. Let our interactions be marked by grace, compassion, and understanding. Lord, your heart aches for the lost and the broken, 
and so does mine. I lift up to you those who have not yet experienced the transformative power of your love. May your spirit draw them near, open their hearts to your truth, and bring them into your fold. Use me as an instrument of your love, that I may share your gospel and be a beacon of hope to those in need. Father, in a world that often clamors for more, I pray for a heart of gratitude and contentment. Help me to recognize and appreciate the countless blessings that surround me each day. May I find joy in the simple pleasures of life and contentment in your presence, knowing that you are the source of true fulfillment. Lord, I join my prayers with those who seek the peace of Jerusalem, a city that holds immense significance in your divine plan. I pray for the safety and well-being of its inhabitants and for the resolution of conflicts that persist in the region. May your peace, which transcends all understanding, extend to the land where your chosen people dwell. Heavenly Father, I recognize the allure of temptation and the frailty of human nature. I beseech you to deliver me from the snares of temptation and to grant me the strength to resist its enticements. Let your word be a lamp to my feet, guiding me.